don't want to bake a whole turkey this year well today i am going to show you guys how to make this melt in your mouth turkey wings recipe this recipe is extremely easy to make and of course it's absolutely flavorful before i begin please take a quick moment to subscribe if you're new to my channel like this video for me if you enjoy it and let's jump right into the recipe Here's what you need to make today's recipe. I'm using turkey wings, chicken broth, onion and bell peppers, a little bit of butter, as well as some turkey gravy mix. For the seasoning, I'm using Creole seasoning, chicken bouillon, Italian seasoning, onion and garlic powder, paprika, ground black pepper, and some celery salt. Let's go. Before you begin, make sure your turkey is nice and clean and pat dry. I'm going to add about one tablespoon of olive oil to my turkey. Then I am going to rub that in just like so. Then I'm going to grab my seasonings. These seasoning combinations are perfect for this recipe. It's so flavorful all together. So I'm going to use a spoon to mix everything together so everything can be well incorporated. And then I am going to generously season my turkey with that. Now, when you add the seasoning, make sure you rub it in. Don't just sprinkling and just move the turkey around. Make sure you rub it in. Make sure you get in the the, the turkey meat. If you want, you can even slice your turkey, you know, just to make sure the seasoning really get in there. Here's a quick close up on how I season it. I'm giving it a nice luxurious massage to make sure all the crevices, all the meat is nice and seasoned, all right? Once you're done seasoning your turkey, here is what you're going to do. You're going to grab your onion in as well as your bell peppers. This recipe is going to be one of your to-go recipe, I promise you. It's so easy to prep and the result, okay? The outcome is so, so bomb. Now, if you can, try to put the bell peppers at the bottom of the turkey. Do not put it on top. You might burn your bell peppers, depends on how hot your oven is. But yeah, I put mine on top. Yeah, you'll see why I said that later on. But now I am going to add the turkey gravy mix to my chicken broth. Mix that up together until it's nice and um, diluted, I guess. And then you're going to pour all that all over the turkey do not pour it on top directly as you can see i pour it on the edge like the corners because i don't want to just run all of that seasoning off the turkey with the with the chicken broth so once you're done adding that you are going to add some butter it's going to be nice and buttery and juicy so you gotta have that butter i'm using unsalted butter by the way keep that in mind okay once i'm done adding the butter i am going to bake this on 380 for about well i cover it make sure to cover it first for about one hour then i am going to uncover it for another 30 minutes let it boil on low i don't know i'm using a gas stove if you're using some other type of stove you might have to boil it for less time but once it's done you guys this is your final result i had to transfer it because you can see it was the the edges was a little burnt but let me tell you this turkey right here is 20 out of 10 it's so bomb your guests will be begging you for this recipe it's so 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 good this will be a staple in your home especially for thanksgiving hope you try it soon it's so good all right Okay guys, let's give this turkey wings a try. It looks amazing, it smells amazing. 
I can't wait, so let's give it a try. It's so juicy, all the gravy in there. And of course, delicious. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Now, this recipe is 20 out of 10. Okay, it's that good. It's so flavorful. The turkey is nice and tender. The gravy is where all the flavor sits, okay? The, the turkey just drip all of that sauce, that goodness in the gravy, and it tastes so, so, so good. I hope you enjoyed today's recipe. Hopefully you try it. Do not forget to subscribe. Leave a like for me if you enjoyed today's recipe, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.